नमस्कार आई एम डॉक्टर अमित भारद्वाज आई वेलकम यू ऑल फॉर इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग फॉर थर्टी फर्स्ट ऑफ मे आउ इफ यू टॉक अबाउट द पास ट्वेंटी फोर आवर वेदर ऑब्जर्व स्पेसिफिकली फॉर रेनफॉल अमाउंट एज वी ऑलरेडी नो दैट देर वॉज अ येस्टरडे डीप डिप्रेशन विच इज वी कैन इन टू अ वेल मार्क लो प्रेशर एरिया एट ट्वेल्व यू टी सी येस्टरडे इट इज फर्दर वी कैन इन टू अ लो प्रेशर एरिया एट जीरो यू टी सी ऑफ टूडे एंड इट इज बिकमिंग लो प्रेशर एरिया बिकमिंग अ लेस मार्क एट थ्री यू टी सी टूडे एंड ड्यू टू दैट देर इज अ एक्सेप्शनली हैवी रेनफॉल अमाउंट विच इज बिन रिपोर्टेड ओवर मेघालय रीजन वन ऑफ द स्टेशन सोरा विच रिसीव फोर्टी सेवन सेंटीमीटर ऑफ रेनफॉल अमाउंट and there are widespread rainfall activity has happened over assam and meghalaya and nmt regions where the rainfall amount is uh, been reported over these station very to very heavy as well as heavy rainfall amount and if you see uh, other activity of the observation thunderstorm accompanied with 70 to 80 kmph uh, one of the station reported 81 kmph over assam and meghalaya regions and other mats you can see where the thunderstorm activity with the gustiness wind between 40 to 70 are been reported are listed here now if we talk about the today's uh, synoptic system as you already know that uh, the northern limit of monsoon continue to pass through mumbai ahilyanagar adidabad uh, bhawani patna puri uh, sandhad island so this is the current location now if we talk about the low pressure area that low pressure area uh, which was in the morning was over northeast assam and uh neighborhood become less mark but the associated cyclonic circulation in the lower tropospheric level is seen over arunachal pradesh there is also uh, another system uh, western disturbance uh, which is now seen as a cyclonic circulation over north pakistan and adjoining uh, jammu and kashmir region between lower and middle tropospheric level there is also a cyclonic circulation over central central pakistan and there is a a trough line which is passing from that cyclonic circulation to northwest uttar pradesh across punjab and haryana in lower tropospheric level and there is also a north south trough which you can see over northeast uttar pradesh to east vidarbha so these are the synoptic system if we are talking about the highlights so heavy to very heavy rainfall is likely to continue or continue over northeastern states and sub himalayan west bengal and sikkim region till uh, first although the amount of heavy to very heavy is uh, been given there but red color warning alert has been issued for northeastern states as well as sub himalayan west bengal and if you are talking about uh, rainfall along with thunderstorm gusty winds over northeast of india due to this wd will continue till next 3 to 4 days and uh, there are heavy to very heavy rainfall likely to continue over kerala karnataka during next 4 to 5 days south interior karnataka till 2nd june konkan and goa till 3rd of june so these are the highlights so we'll uh, first discuss about the temperature forecast so there will be a uh, rise by 2 degree celsius in maximum temperature which is likely over northwest of india next 24 hours then it will be fall by 2 to 3 degree celsius during next 3 days and then rise by 2 to 3 degree celsius thereafter there will be no significant change in maximum temperature over east india during next 24 hours then there will be gradual rise by 3 to 5 degree celsius in maximum temperature uh, for next 4 uh, days and thereafter no large change and there will be gradualized by 2 to 3 degrees celsius in maximum temperature or uh, madhya pradesh during next 5 days then thereafter no large change and there is no large change during rest part of the country so uh, these are the multi hazard map for the day one warning as you can see that red warning alert has been issued for north eastern states including assam and meghalaya arunachal pradesh and uh, nmt regions where the heavy to very heavy rainfall can occur and with the constant uh, Uh, downpouring of the rainfall this uh, multi hazard red warning alert has been issued for these states so uh, if we talk about other orange warning where heavy to very heavy rainfall can occur it is sub himalayan west bengal region and if we go to the west coast of india uh, which include coastal karnataka and kerala region where heavy to very heavy rainfall can occur you can also see that uh, if we go to the jammu and kashmir himachal pradesh there heavy rainfall with uh, thunderstorm and the gusty wind can occur the gustiness in the wind can go up to 50 to 60 gusting to uh, 70 wind reach up to that so orange warning alert has been issued for that region the other regions uh, where the isolated heavy rainfall activity can occur is uttarakhand 
बिहार झारखंड आइसोलेट लोकेशन ऑफ उड़ीसा एंड कोस्टल आंध्र प्रदेश एंड साउथ इंटीरियर कर्नाटका वी आर हैवी रेन फॉर वार्निंग अलर्ट हैज बीन इशूड फॉर टुडे द अदर येलो मार्क रीजन यू कैन सी दैट आइसोलेट थंडर स्ट्रॉम एक्टिविटी कैन अकर ओवर दोज रीजन so that's all uh, for day one warning if we go for day two as you can see that north east of india there will be a reduction in the rainfall amount and the day two orange warning alert has been issued there for day two very heavy rainfall amount the very heavy rainfall amount over himachal pradesh uh, will be there with thunderstorm and lightning uh, activity heavy to very heavy rainfall amount for himachal pradesh other places isolated thunderstorm activity and west coast of india heavy rainfall uh, is likely over uh, konkan and goa कोस्टल कर्नाटका साउथ इंडिया कर्नाटका एंड केरल रीजन विच विल कंटिन्यू फॉर नेक्स्ट थ्री टू फोर डेज नेक्स्ट फोर टू फाइव डेज ओवर वेस्ट कोस्ट ऑफ इंडिया एंड जॉइनिंग रीजन विल कंटिन्यू फॉर हैवी रेनफॉल इफ यू गो फॉर ऑरेंज कलर एंड वार्निंग फॉर डे थ्री यू कैन सी दैट राजस्थान रीजन वेयर फॉर थ्री फोर एंड फाइव डेज थंडर स्ट्रॉम लाइटनिंग विद द डस्ट स्ट्रॉम वार्निंग हैज बिन इशूड सो फॉर वेस्ट राजस्थान रीजन एंड सम आइसोलेटेड एक्टिविटी और ईस्ट राजस्थान thunderstorm lightning with gusty winds can also occur now uh, if we go for day 4 to day 7 as you can see that the rainfall amount is reducing northeast uh, if india will see isolated uh, heavy rainfall amount warning has been issued for day 4 to day 7 although uh, other parts if we consider the west coast of india for day or day 4 and day 5 the heavy rainfall amount is been reducing uh orange warning alert has been issued for uh, west rajasthan with thunderstorm and gust wind it will last till 4th and then later on the intensity uh, of uh, other warning is not there for day 6 and day 7 now as per as fisherman warning graphics as you can see that these mark polygon uh, with yellow and gray color uh, these are the area which are been uh, will be prone in gray color with the squally weather and the yellow region where the squally wind uh, up to the wind speed of 45 to 55 gusting to 65 can occur fishermen are advised not to venture in these marked regions so that's all for today you can actually get the updated and detailed information from imd website you can also follow us uh, on twitter instagram and facebook to get the updated information so that's all namaskar dhanyawad